One sweep is nothing. It doesn't. It, it means nothing about the Hello everyone. Uh, we here in my gym saw you soon. Uh, last weekend, like we already uh, find a very exciting Sega Super Fight too. And yes, it's the for me it's the one of the best uh, rugby event so far. Now we we try to uh, give people uh, new perspective. And not new, but uh, different perspective of the rappling game. Or oh, it's just not about winning or uh, winning pipe but the point. We just try to uh, finishing the other guys and make the um, make rappling become a spectacular sport. It's no no boring. Not, it's not boring like uh, like IBJF event or other event. We will already know. We will just. Uh, play the role to win, yeah. We we'll just try to make it fun, more action, and try to finish in the other guys. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about Soy Jiu Jitsu. Uh, how long have you guys been here? When did it start? Yeah, we, we, we started like 2011. Yes, at the time, like, no black belt here. Uh, at the time, I only like uh, 23 years old and just watching DVD and gathering a uh, guy in the neighborhood to train, just rapple each other. And we just, people just come and go and only me then last until now. So it's like 13 years so far. Wow, 13 years so Soy Jiu Jitsu. And has it been in this location the whole time? Uh, this location is from 2019, so we in location. Yeah. And how many total grapplers do you have uh, here at Soy, and how many how many have you had over the past 13 years? Uh, I uh, I cannot remember exactly, just because we will just come and go, and uh, we I already trained like for a few generation of uh, national athlete. And here now here we have around like 30 people now. Oh, okay, 30. Okay. Yeah, the uh, everyone very good here. Lots of uh, lots of technique, uh, lots of heel hooks and and uh, and everything. Uh, so very good uh, coaching and technique here. So about uh, Saigon Super Fights last weekend, um, you guys, lots of brotherhood, lots of uh, spirit, lots of community. Uh, share just a little bit about Soy Jiu Jitsu, their perform your performance, and what was the feeling uh, throughout the day. Um, here we go. I just want to see uh, my students. They can perform like one hundred percent of them, and uh, as long as they go one hundred percent. Uh, it doesn't matter if they win or lose. I just want to see them go 100%. Yeah. Do, do you feel, are you proud of their performance last weekend? Uh, most of them, yes, already go 100%, their potential, and uh, I'm quite happy with the result. Um, at the end of the day, it's just about like winning yourselves and just uh, win or lose the, the other guys, it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah for sure. So, so this Saigon Super Fights 2 is all about learning ADCC rules and trying to, to bring resources to Vietnamese grapplers, prepare them to go to ADCC and these other tournaments. But you had, you had a, ba a really good idea. Will you share those ideas with us? Yeah, I think like to make uh, rappling become a spectacular ball sport, uh, we just need to simplify the rules so everybody can understand. So if like we just do like submission only like like 15 minutes, and if both guys cannot finish, so they both go home with just little money. If they can finish, so a big a bigger money. So like the MMA guy or uh, judo guy wrestler, they, they cannot, they, do, um, they don't need to understand the rule set. They just 
go 100% and try to finish the opponent. So very easy to understand the rule of the games. So easier to attract people to play and easier for the um, the audience to, to watch the match, I think. Yeah. And make it exciting because people just people no longer play the rule to win. You yeah. cannot win by oh, one advantage or uh, one sweep. Uh, yeah, that a lot of then we, we, when you you guys train like many years, see that win by one sweep is nothing. It doesn't. It means nothing about the the uh, go uh, the damage or the test thirst that you can bring to the other guys, right? Yes. Yeah, I think that that's a good point. So we want to make this a spectator sport. Yeah. We want to make it exciting. We want to make it simple. But you know, that focuses on what really matters yeah, yes. in jujitsu, which is submission. Really, submission is what we do it. You, you, you know, uh, not a sweep or points. It really doesn't. That really doesn't matter. So I, th I think that's a really good point. Um, okay, so great. So what does that look like? How many minutes? Uh, how long would the matches be? Uh, what do you think? Uh, as the the sub so yeah, you can see that lies. If uh, ten minutes. When you when we go for the overtime and people will uh, tie, tie. So the longer the match go, so you can see the difference between the the technical gap of the two guys, right? So I think uh, 15 minutes is enough to so for one guy to finish the other. If they if they really have the 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 technical gap. Yeah. And and 50 minutes is enough to for the more technical guys to to try the the stronger guys, right? Because yeah. very short time cannot like I cannot if 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 I go like five minutes you 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 will win me for sure. And have no chance to to again check in the five minute rule set. Definitely like 100 percent, like 200 percent. I will lost <laughs> because I have no time to to try check. Yeah, I better, right. uh, I better get myself in shape then. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. So now it's okay. So we look at a 15-minute rule set. Yeah. Let's say it's in a cage. Okay, right? Yes, it's good because like, people, like, people cannot avoid dance. People must yeah. engage each other and use. And so the 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 match will not um, stop by go out pow mm. and. And it attract more MMA guys, you know, because they they get familiar with the case, and the other Yuzu guys not. Uh, in other aspect, uh, Yuzu guys will familiar with the five to six minute match, yeah. while the MMA guy, the, the MMA guy is trained for, to last like 15 to 25 minutes. So you will see a uh, different aspect of the wrestling games. It's different than the thing that we train every day. Yes. Yeah, that's a really good point. So we got a simplified rule set, 15 minutes submission only. Everyone can understand that. Yes. Now MMA guys can, can play, yeah. and they don't have to learn a bunch of rules. Yeah. So yeah, that, and the jiu-jitsu guys are going to have to get in shape yes, yes. because the MMA guys are already in shape, yeah. and they can really. And they, can, they must play smarter. Yeah. They are smarter than before. They might adjust the the strategy and tactic to to match with the intensity of the match and to last in the match 15 minutes. Fantastic! That's a great idea, yeah. actually. And uh, yeah, awesome. I think I think that we can make that happen. Yeah, I think that we can make that happen. Um, and we can bring in a lot of different gyms throughout the country, and and see what happens. Yeah. Any other any other any other comments about uh, that rule set or the Saigon Super Fights three or maybe the cage matches or anything about your team? Me? Uh, anything else you'd like to say? Uh, me, I I hope last 
uh, everyone who train use like more than one or two years it should just compete for fun, you know. You lose nothing. Just come and have fun. It's uh, for me like compete is uh, like um, I know I would say like you you rebel for the things. Then you go out there and you you give one percent. Then you deal with the the result, win or lose, and then you just repeat the cycle. It's it trains your mental toughness. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So we want to encourage everyone to go out and compete, yeah. and it doesn't matter if you lose, winning or losing doesn't matter. What matters is the, you come out, you compete with your team. We do this as a community, and we all grow together by doing these different rule sets. Yeah. And now now the MMA folks can can join everybody can join easy and it's fun to watch Tong Lai champion champion Saigon Super Fights yeah no not, not lucky but how how long have you been training here at Soy Jiu Jitsu uh, I have I have been in here for two uh, five years since uh, 2020 and I have the first time I have trained in Tain Flightness in uh, America. Then I found that this gym uh, is near my house here. Oh, wow. So I didn't know him, the, the, the owner, Wooden Thing. So I checked uh, him on Facebook and I see many comments about him. Like he's just uh, a bad guy who just uh, rule everyone. And I, I want to challenge him because uh, I was a blue belt at that time in uh, 2020, and he's just a white belt. And, I, and then I came here, then I came here, and I rode with him, and he just <laughs> smacked me like 20 times. I, I tapped 20 times in five minutes. Oh my God. And I was like, dude, what the hell is this guy? Yeah. And, and from that moment, I, I think... I. This guy is something special about him. Yes. So, so I choose to stay here and keep training, training. So this year is the five year I have been here. Wow. Until here. Wow, that's an incredible story. Yes. So, so you've been here for five years. What are some of the things that you like about training, not only with Dian and but also the rest of the team? So people here is friendly. So. Everybody come come here not to, not only for training. They come here to understand the everything about martial arts, and I mean they not just come here to fighting. Come here to uh, re release the the threat after a, a hard working day, and that's it. That is is friendly, friendly. Yes, yes. yeah. And thing, he's, he looked like a gangster, but <laughs> he, he kind of looked a gangster, but I love him because that's the way he looked, but inside is a, a, a good person, yes. a good teacher, a good coach. Yeah, yeah he's very good. It, it, was, it was amazing to see uh, your team yes. last weekend mm -hmm. at, at Saigon Super Fights. And we all, like, I know for me, I thought it was very special how you guys came together and supported each other. You had the coaches, the competitors, you had a, a lot of support and uh, a, a very big showing at, at uh, Saigon Super Fights. Can you talk a little bit about what it's like to be a part of, of Soy Jiu Jitsu at a competition like Saigon Super Fights? So you mean like uh, have to be a part of Soy Jiu Jitsu? In a, in a yeah, to go as a team. Oh, to go how, as, how did that feel? Oh, that's feel. So, it's not only for Saigon Super Five for every competition. So, like national competition, uh, CADA, uh, or any kind of, uh, of uh, competition. We want the whole team, not only the fighter, the one, the 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 one who go to support. We have to go everyone, just to support the fighter. We not win or lose. We don't care. We just want to be together in that competition. And then we take a picture, and then we uh, show up people that we are, we are a team. 
and to support, to support, we just want to support. We don't want, we don't care that you lose, you win. Yes. Got the medal or not, we don't care that about that. So that's how Sorry to so team work uh, until right now and in the future, yeah, for, for the future too. Yeah. Very good. Uh, do you guys have any any new competitions coming up soon yeah. this year? Uh, I think for the CADA uh, at the end of the year, maybe. And for next year, we will sum up us, we will go to uh, uh, national champion. Uh, yeah, um, and in uh, November I go to uh, ADCC in Malaysia with uh, Hong. Yes. 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 And have you registered yet? Uh, I'm doing. I work. I work to uh, uh, renew my visa, my uh, passport. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's. It's. I got it. I will get it uh, next year, uh, next week. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Great. Uh, make sure you register because ADCC Malaysia keep asking me. Yeah, because uh, it, it's you can register now. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. You can do it as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you need help, just let me know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Hey, thank, uh, thank you so much. It was incredible watching, watching you, uh, last weekend. Yes. It was incredible. You and your whole team, everyone doing very good job, with a smile on your face. You know, <laughs> no matter no matter what happens, you, uh, you guys in the finals, it was great. Yeah. For me, Jiu-Jitsu is not uh, a fighting. It's just a game that everybody comes to try together. So, of, of course, happiness is uh, the first thing uh, we, we want. Yeah. So that's one I, I want. I want fun. So I keep smiling. Even that's uh, Tommy, the, the little one. He's a good fighter. Yes. But maybe he's still young for me right now. But I don't want to hurt him. It's, but that's the good fight I have so far right now. Uh, okay, last question. What are some other things? Because Saigon Super Fights is really a community event. We just bring the community together. Uh, your uh, your coach had some ideas on what the next one could be like. What are some What are some things that we could change next time to make it a better event for the community? Oh yeah. Okay. So I think for the next events. We need like more fighter in the brackets. For example, like 77, 77 or 88. And we we have I I heard that many fighter want to try the super fight, yeah. but uh, they didn't know about the the event. So it, un, until they know the event is closed, the register yeah. is closed. So yeah. maybe I think we we. If if we have a chance, we can uh, upgrade the the number of the fighter in the bracket. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's that's gonna be fun. Like uh, a lot of fighter, good fighter, come to join, and many good fight will happen in in the uh, yeah in the events. Okay. Hey, thank you so much. Is there anything else? Anything else you'd like to share uh, with the world? Okay. So, uh, everyone. Please come to Soul Jiu Jitsu. Uh, we have open mat every Sunday, 10 a.m. Come to Soul with us. We're not gonna hurt you guys. <laughs> we just want fun. And shout out to Saigon Saga, Zach Russ, and everybody in, in the team for the amazing uh, work for grappling community in, in Vietnam, in Saigon. Thank you. Hey. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much, man. Next time we roll. Next time yes, we roll. Yes, yes. Hey, take it easy on me. No, you easy on me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, here we have yes. Jackie Ang, veteran, Saigon Super Fights. He's uh, had two Saigon Super Fights. Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is uh, Tonang. Uh, everyone know me by uh, Jack. My name is uh, Jackie. Yeah. Uh, until now, I training BJJ about uh, four years. Uh, when I beginning to BJJ, I learned, I changed at the, my hometown is uh, Haiphong. It's a uh, Tiger, uh, Tiger Club. Yes, yes, um, yes, yes. Uh, and when uh, 20, 20, 20 year, I come back to Saigon. I joined to the LSC, uh under the um, training by Coach Pablo and Anthony. And so I uh, 
I trained with uh, Mr. Anthony under the Zozu uh, until now. I am a member of Over Limit uh, under the chain of uh, Kotani Sensei. Um, with me, when I joined the chain uh, BJJ, I about the 40, um, 45 year, 45 year. Until now, I'm uh, 48. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's uh, with I'm an old man. And my friend said, "Oh, Jackie, you are crazy, because uh, this uh, the BJJ is the the very dan dangerous, uh, dangerous." Uh, Oh, I, I, I don't, I, I don't. I said I don't think so, but I, I, I want to try uh, until now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, well, when I um, what twenty, uh, two thousand twenty-two, I um, have an injury, uh, injury, and I changed my mind before. I, when I train, I using so much power. The same year, young guy, we should, we should very hard, but I cannot do everything. Uh, after I injury, uh, with I train with, um, I learn with uh, Kotani Sensei, and I change my mind. When you become the old man, you must be use so much technique, and don't don't use much power and slowly slowly when you change yes, yes. with yeah with uh, a new mentors uh, now I will join the until now about the four or five tournament in the overseas in Malaysia and okay. uh, Philippines and uh, on Thailand yeah until now, I, uh, I got uh, some few medal. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, very, very case crazy with me. <laughs> yeah. I like the, the Nogi, and when the team Vietnam come to, i so happy. Team yeah, Vietnam. team Vietnam, Vietnam team. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, anything else you would like to share uh, before we end today? Uh, yes. I was... Uh, Today I want to uh, to say them. Uh, you are young or you are the old. Don't worry, don't worry for John uh, to change BJJ. Important. What? Uh, what can you do and what you want to do? Okay, the same me, the same the, the like me. Uh, I think have a so much uh, old men like me when John to train uh, to train BJJ and to uh, join the um, uh, playground same in the made by Saigon Saga by the uh, Mr. Jack uh, thank you so much for the oh, yeah. um, make the, the uh, playground for, uh, for yeah. us Course, uh, for yeah. the, the Vietnam team, yeah. yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Hey, yeah, yeah. hey thank you for for supporting us and, and and so we could make this happen. Yeah. Hey, thank you so much. Yeah. All right, so man. Much, yeah.